Hey, Mac, I had a, I was just wondering, when was the, do you remember the first time you ever picked up a 1911? And also, um, uh, what didn't you like about the uh, HK416? Because I remember you talked about that in the podcast. The first time I ever picked up a 1911 was when I was in first group because the 1911 was still the secondary weapon system uh, in in the army. <clears throat> and that was in the 80s. <clears throat> but I didn't learn how to use it until I got to Delta. <laughs> you know, because once I got there, I, I, I didn't know that I didn't know. I didn't know what I didn't know. And I didn't know that I sucked at shooting until I went to freaking Delta. And then now we had custom built. 1911s and um man i picked that shit up quick though but i had really good instructors and um man i just fell in love with that platform it's still my favorite platform now 416 so when we started uh this right after the gwap right right after gwap started um i picked up a 416 i think an 02 uh, went down, zeroed it, trained with it for three days, brought it back to the arms room and said, give me my M4 back. For a number of reasons. Number one, it's not a battlefield multiplier. There's no advantage to having a 416. Number two, it's heavier. It's heavier. Dude, ounces make pounds, you know? And when you got freaking 60 pounds of lightweight shit on and you have to run like a like a freaking greased ape, you, you don't you don't want extra pounds and then even the magazines were freaking heavier i mean h and k 416 magazines they're a solution to a problem that doesn't exist let's make a new magazine it's heavier it's black it's real freaking it's real metal you know um so it, the other thing is gas impingement to piston i did not like the way it felt i could feel the moving pieces in the piston and I did not like that way it registered on the cheek stock weld and how it felt. I was not alone there. A lot of guys switched up when we still had the option, when the M4s were still in um, inventory. Uh, so I was not alone because the only advantage at the time to having a 416 is what? It runs cooler, less maintenance. That was it. <laughs> that wasn't good enough for me. Never had a problem with the M4, yeah. and I still haven't had a problem with any of my AR platforms, any of them. And I run those hard, man. When do I clean them? I don't know. I would two thousand rounds, something like that. If that, I just keep putting oil on them, and then and then uh, uh, making sure the uh, the bore's clean. 